Welcome to Historic Malacca. Hello from Malacca, charming historical city in Malaysia, very close to Kuala Lumpur. We had a blast here in the morning. Hola. Okay. That was in my previous video. If you haven't seen, no worries, you can watch it later. Stay with us here to see how this day continues. Look at this, they discovered more rooms of the Portuguese wall. Let's go for a boat tour to see a little bit more of the river. Boat tours seem to be very traditional here. You buy the ticket close to that square, but you get the boat all the way there. And boats are every 30 minutes. Masuk. One thing for you to know about Malacca and be prepared, most businesses here only take cash. You know, even tourist attractions that you'd expect them to take credit card, they don't. Restaurants, cafes, forget it. The only place that took credit card so far was the tower this morning. Pack your bags. Welcome to Historic Malacca! So much street art, right? Yes. Really nice. To the left of the river is the Baba That was a typical Malay house built without any nails, just with pieces that uh, are assembled together. The Malay Living Museum, Villa Santosa. The best preserved typical Malay house of a rich Malaysian family in the early 20th century. There is an audio guide in English explaining what you're saying. Just like the Portuguese and the Dutch had their churches, this is the church that best represents the British here in Malacca. Bye, terima kasih. Wedding? Yeah. Oh, how nice! <laughs> oh, beautiful! Full we'll break again to recharge the energy. But first, let me show you an interesting place that you can see from up here. That's the Malacca Straits Mosque. It's an interesting mosque as it's located on a man-made island and uh, when the water level is high, it looks like it's floating. I ended up not mentioning in the first vlog here in Malacca that all that part uh, near the fort, a famosa, the Portuguese fort, all that is land reclamation because the ocean used to be there. These are really part of Malacca and it's amazing how loud they are. When I think about the way we used to be, when I think about the things we Oh wow, this is like a theme park. I know that I am so much better. Night market. This is the place to come on weekends, you know, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Everything coconut. 
Nutella here. This is the dessert for sure. Portuguese egg tart. <laughs> Which one? This one on top? Yeah. Yeah. This one? This one, please. Just one. Let's try it. So good. You see the eggs here inside? It's a little sweet, but not sweet at the same time. Love it, love it, love it. Really good. Store is here still open. This is the most unique. Manicure on the street. This might be good. There's a huge line here. <laughs> Do you want one? No. Crab has an appetizer. Amazing. You ask them how does it taste like? Yeah. Yeah, what did they say? It tastes like crab. Yeah, and it's not spicy. Not and spicy? Yeah. Aren't you curious? No. <laughs> Hundred percent natural. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I thought I'd get it right there, but no. She took it behind to steam it, and it took about five minutes. And uh, here it is. And then I got my chocolate face. Here. Oh, it's so hot. Really hot. Really hot. This is so cute. I don't want to eat it. <laughs> oh, there you go. Mm. It's like a donut, but not deep fried, so it's healthier. <laughs> that come up the straw. It is so good, good choice. Bye, thank you. Terima <laughs> kasih. Chinese burger, three for ten, three for ten. Which one do you get? They're selling this as Chinese burger. There are two sides of eggs and then some kind of filling. I got chicken honey. Oh, so here's the chicken. It's just a slice in the middle. It's not like shredded chicken, but it is good. It is very good. I thought it would be a little sweet because of chicken honey, but no, not at all. But it, it is good. It's really good. This can easily become one of my favorite snacks. It's really good. Ice cream. What yeah. flavors you have? A vanilla, peppermint, and chocolate. Four flavors. Yeah. And yum. Oh, I'll get vanilla, please. Okay, no problem. It's fried ice cream. I'm gonna try. Thank you. Oops. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you very much. Is it you? Ice cream is still cold, and then you have the hot part outside. It is good, it's a good combination. So I want to find the coconut. Yeah. How much is it? What do you get? Four? Yes, I'll get one. Okay. Thank you. Coconut, coconut. This is like heaven. It's so good. It's so sweet. Love it, love it, love it. It's coconut ice cream on top, and this is a coconut shake, like a coconut smoothie. It is so good, so sweet. 
Malacca is so much more than expected. It is really charming. You know, when you do your research online, you see how nice it is. You see the pictures, right, of the architecture. But when you get here, you realize how close everything is, everything within walking distance, people so friendly. This is everywhere in Malaysia. People are very friendly everywhere. I'm really in love with the city. I'd certainly come back here. So charming, so cute. It's such a shame. This is our last video in Malaysia. If this is the first video you watch, come to this playlist that I'm linking here. There is Kuala Lumpur, Putrajaya, Penang, and here Malacca. We've got sugar cane juice here. Another similarity with Brazil. I'm sure you don't want to try it. It's really good. So what do you think? It's good. Just good? I think it's more vanilla than it is coconut. You think? Mm -hmm. This is probably my favorite. It is really good. Is it? Yeah. What well, now you say? I see a lot of people having that. Uh, Let's try. Yeah, you can. No way! <laughs> the thing's called Dragon Breath. The heat is getting to you. You come to do a time lapse and forget the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what you can still save. 